Hello and welcome back to the Drophior Gaming Channel. This is Baldur's Gate 3, our Drow Ranger playthrough. This fella here with the leather helmet on. It's gonna be episode 7. Did I just say that? Either way, we're gonna be moving into the Blighted Village. We already know there's gonna be goblins in here. But in earlier playthroughs this was a tough fight but honestly right now I'm not even too worried about it because these guys are uh, are pretty tough we already acquired scratch acquired scratch in the last video and we merely that if the eyes are the mirror to the soul, yours have dark curtains across the mirror. No offense taken, I hope. Not necessarily. I haven't made up my mind about you yet. Hmm. Open up. Dead goblins. Dead travelers. Were they heading to the Druid's Grove? Well, these guys had some good stuff. We're gonna send this to the camp. Everything else we're taking. Sending everything to Gale as far as the scrolls go. That will definitely uh, send to the camp because it's worth a little bit. We'll leave the quarter staff. I like how they, they um, it looks like they changed the weight of some of the things. See that says 0 0.9, 0 0.005. I don't think it was like that before. Let's have a look at this. Drawn in thick charcoal lines upon an animal skin, this childlike portrait depicts three stick figures. This is pretty much saying that there's three goblin leaders. Our journal will have updated and said as much. All right, let's go ahead and breathe deep and move. Ooh, let's get this. I don't recall that. There's a backpack over here as well. Let's look at the What's backpack. <clears throat> Some sun melon piece. All right, I'll buy that for a dollar. What's the uh, dead tiefling got on him? Vermin on the rooftops. Yeah, I'm aware. Let's um. I'm not even gonna worry about it. I think we're just going to. Should I come in from a different angle? Nah, fuck it. Front door. Light on my feet. Get over there! Surround him like. Yeah, I know you're there. You spotted us. Good. It's like they say. Wait. A drow in the sun. Stand down. This one's got a touch of the absolute about him. Apologies, your lordship. Hard making you out from a distance. Hmm. Well, this was a different turn of events here. You should pluck your eyes out. Please, your greatness. Was an honest mistake, is all. You'll get no more trouble from us. Promise. Well, that's somewhat of a shame. I kind of wanted to fight him. Well, if that's how things are gonna be, let's have a look. Let's have a look. All camp supplies, nice. You can't reach. You can reach it. Come over here. Oh, you no traps, punk. please. All right, since they didn't want to. 
fight. Something good here, I hope. I hope. There's nothing at all. Wonder if the gods We're gonna go over me. here and have a talk with the uh, old Fezzer. I mean, me old you friend. Oh. Sing for me, Roach. Tell me everything you know. Wow. <laughs> I know you ain't seeing much out of that eye pebble of yours. And there's an army of us, and just a couple of you. So you ain't the one gonna be asking questions. Your parasite burns in concert with Will's Rubbish. paralyzing rage. And a hunger for answers. Stand with me, mate. Knock him out, but keep him breathing. I've got some questions to ask. And I'll burn the answers from his shite stained throat. Alright, I'm down for that. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that! The captain grew some bollocks. Ooh. Took six damage right away. Six, six damage. Okay, here we go. All four of us are getting. I should have casted a familiar with a uh, wheel. That's unfortunate. But. It is not the end of the world. Cause I can come right here and do burning hands. Nice. Nice. That was good. I like that. Ooh. Kind of a big hit there. Let's um do that. If I were to move away. Oh shit. He missed. Good deal. Okay. Um there we go. Sixty experience points. Oh we killed him. We killed him. Damn it. Hey, we can raise the dead. We can raise the dead. This might not, we might not even win this fight though. This is, um, not going well. Okay. This is not going well at all. Let's do... Ensnaring strike on him. Try to... We missed. Shit. Ah. 
We are in big trouble right now. Oh. Big trouble. <clears throat> oh. Why is it only 49%, 56%? Not that one, Dan. Mm. What if I did this one? No. Shit, what about... Man, that's terrible. Eight. Damn. Knock out the cockroach. I want him alive. He's already dead, bro. I think we're going I don't think we're gonna make it through this one. This is not good. This is not good. Bonus action in the spell slot. Okay. And then a snare strike melee. Impotibi. Nice. Okay. Now then. Mm. This ain't good. <laughs> This really ain't good. <sighs> Let's do a level two witch bolt. Oh, what the hell? I don't even know what happened then. Struggling. We are struggling. That wasn't smart. That was not smart. All right, we'll do better next time. Maybe we should try to be a little bit more diplomatic or something. I don't know. Oh, I have a potion. Okay, whatever. Let's load game. Let's load game. So, might want to be a bit more careful. In fact, Merely these boots have seen the everything. eyes are the mirror to the soul. Yours have dark curtains of dead goblins. No offense taken. Right? Travelers. Were they not necessarily? All right. Anything of use? Vermin on the rooftops. All right, let's see if we can do this again. Very well. Get over there! Surround him, like. 
Yeah, we already know you're there. You've spotted us. Good. It's like they say. Wait. A drow. In the sun. Stand down. This apologies, your lordship. I'll Don't let it happen again. Oh, oh. Move it, lads. And show. Okay. Hush your face. Hush up. What's inside? So maybe, well, maybe before we mess with those guys, dude, what are you doing? What in the hell are you doing? This dude might not be the smartest guy in the world. Alright, well since you're going this way, let's stop here. Have a look around. Why is my camera... I don't want to quite be that, that far up, but okay. I didn't want to do that. A pot to, what is it? Apothecaries, is that how you say it? Apothecary? Whatever, it's a book. We're gonna read it. It says there's a cellar here somewhere. Okay. Looks like that might be it right there. Um. Potion of sleep. Potion of healing. I'll take that. Might be useful. I don't even want that. Well, I'll take the antitoxin. Fit in my pack. Sinicide is probably going to be spiders down here. More for me. Hmm. Anything of use? I know there's goblins over here. I need to get up some gold before I come back. That way I can bribe them. I think you need a thousand gold. Ooh, and I think I know where to get a thousand gold too. Open up. French philosophy, missives of Candlekeep. Have I read these? Huh. Okay, I'm actually going to take that book. I'm going to take this book as well. I'm going to read those on my own time. If you guys want to read them, you can pause the video. <clears throat> inside. Ooh. I don't know why I say ooh like that. Does it only uh, worth a little bit of money? That's about it. Alright, let's head down here. Alright then, let's go ahead and Oh shit. <sighs> All right, let's go ahead and have a look around. These are camp supplies. Okay. I'll take camp supplies. Okay. I'm not upset with that at all. Potion of healing. I need to... I'm in dire need of money. Because I don't have any health potions. Alright. At the ready. I got 10 health potions. What the hell am I talking about? I need to share the wealth, Donna. Oh, I have the magic touch. Oh, you got the, the gate. Let's get on with it. 
Yo, we only got nothing. All's well that ends not as bad as it could have. Let's split this. Six Maybe four. We'll send those to uh Will. Put these on the hot bar. There we go. Then we'll sort by weight, and then we'll sort by value. Or we'll just sort by type. How about that? There we go. Okay. And I ain't gonna go too crazy with it. Actually, I might. No traps, please. Two more health potions, see? What the fuck was that? Moving ahead. Potion of healing. Uh, wish I had a bag of holding. Hmm. Something good here, I hope. What's he got going on? Oh, recast, speak with the dead. Speak with the dead. Okay. Another step forward. I think these are camp supplies as well. Yeah. Okay. Doctor's log. Let's have a look at it. Let's see what this does. Uh. I think that's pretty much the same thing as said before. Oh, don't mind if I do. All right, sorry for that quick cut. My dog decided to absolutely lose his mind, as he does sometimes. With haste. All right, let's, let's search these look. boxes. Nothing on either one of them. But I know from experience, if I move this box, there will be a lever there, or lever, whichever way you want to say it. We're going to go ahead and pour that lever. Never wanted the easy path. And see if we can always room for more. Get some more camp supplies as we move along. Out of these mushrooms. Let's keep going. Okay. Now if I don't auto save as I move into this <sighs> well, area. Catch a break. Best be on my way. I will quick save. There we go. Quick save. Don't waste a step. A is for Azus and other guys too. So I think the other one was number one. This is number two. Still a bunch of mumbo jumbo. Okay. But here's the deal. Nobody's gonna be down here. Everybody's coming up here. Time to press ahead. Well, somebody's got to be down there, don't they? Let me think about who's gonna be down there. Moving in. Swift as my feet can carry me. What you mean, bro? I can get up here. Okay. Well, I guess it looks like. Well, let's go ahead and do a, a long rest. Let's do that first. Okay, this is a cool little camping area here. I like it. What's hiding here? See what Gil has to say. Ah, there you are. <clears throat> How did you enjoy my dear stew this evening? 
It's an old family recipe. I didn't have any actually. Hmm. Curious time to be dieting, especially with a chef like myself around. Not that I mean to regale you with my culinary exploits. There's, uh, well, there's actually something quite different I'd like to discuss. Well, by all means. We've been traveling together for a while now. And during those travels, I've been observing you. I want you to know that I like what I see. The way you diffuse the tension between Zevlor and Aradin. The way you followed the protocol and brought me back to life. In short, I've grown to trust you. Uh. All right. Now I need you to place your trust in me. Our journey together is bound to last a while still. As such, I feel compelled to speak. I say this because there's something I desperately need. But while I'll tell you what that something is, I won't tell you why. I have to ask you to agree to this before carrying on this conversation. Very well. Wait a minute. You sense secrecy and danger. You should... Yeah, I'm not going to do that. Yeah, we'll, we'll agree. Thank you. I see I did well to trust you. Now, to the matter at hand. You see, I have a condition. A condition different from the tadpole, but just as deadly. The only way to appease said condition is for me to take powerful magical artifacts and absorb the weave inside. Okay. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact before we were abducted. It is time. And by that, I mean it's imperative that I find and consume powerful strands of weave at the earliest possible juncture. Um. Where are we supposed to find these artifacts? As luck would have it, Faerun is full of them, though I do feel obliged to point out that items of power tend to be in the hands of the powerful. There'll be danger involved. All great cost. Hmm. Danger. I wouldn't have it any other way. Good. A bit of boldness will serve us well. I know the allure these artifacts hold. I understand their value and their power. All this to say, I understand the sacrifice I ask of you. I hope I can count on you. No worries, mate. What's in here? Let's talk to Shadowheart, see what she has to say. Almost pleasant, traveling with company. If you ignore all the less pleasant aspects. Oh, uh, we should get to know each other a little more. Must we? No mm. harm in a little mystery, don't you think? Hmm. Yeah, we have to rely on each other. Easy is often less interesting. Besides, we've plenty of reason to rely on each other already. You can't confide in just anyone about a monster in your head. This is true. You're deflecting, though. Say for a moment that I was. Do you think your blunt approach would get me to confess? I suppose not. Good. I like you. And you did save my life. I wouldn't want to sour things between us. Not while we need each other. Fair enough. Auto select. Forest. Okay. Now, I'm going to separate. And I'm gonna go open maybe. How much farther can I go? This coffin right here. Oh come on, bro. Come on. There we go. Now what he's gonna do is a level two 
Level two magic missile. One, two, three, four. Tormenta. It almost killed him. Oh man, he almost made it. Okay. Now, what she's gonna do a little sacred flame. Wait a minute, first let's have a let's look at him. Immune to poison, but you would think he would be resist I mean uh vulnerable to radiant. Huh. Let's see what happens. There we go. There we go. Sometimes you're not able to do that. What now? And traps, please. One D eight. Is that better than what I have? Not the same. But what I was gonna say is that. Oh, what the fuck? I didn't expect that. Um, what to do here? Do this. He saved against the snare strike. Let's try to push him. Alright, got him away from me at least, anyways. Um. Why does she? Why, why can she not do anything? Oh, she already spent her action. Well, this didn't work out quite the way I thought it was going to. That's okay though. And I forgot to do the freaking a familiar thing again. My goodness. Ooh, that was a nice hit. That was a nice hit. Uh, level... I want to use my other level two. Level one. On you. Man, he's level 20. I mean, he's got 20 uh, health. Now he's waking up more and more people too, huh? Let's <sighs> do guiding bolt on this individual. Bro, I said... Oh. This one. On this individual. Ooh, 12 damage. Nice. Life comes easy these days. We're gonna do Hail of Thorns on the two of you. One of them went down. And I'm gonna take this potion of speed as well. And I don't have uh, a bonus action. I'll take both of them, wouldn't it? Let's do an ensnaring. Brain strike on this guy. And he's ensnared, which means he can't move and he will take damage every time. Mm. We're gonna hit this guy before he does his dirty deeds. Down you go. Down you go. Now you are going to cast a sphere of ugliness over here. There we go. You knew you wasn't gonna make that. What were you thinking? What were you thinking? I'm just gonna do I'll try to do a pin down on him. He is pinned down, which means that, um... Uh, 
his movement speed is reduced by three. Okay, he can still move if he wanted though. He's all that matters. I don't think he will. So I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna do. Um. So I'll do a pin down on him as well. I guess. Or I'll just kill him. How about that? Okay. What is going on? Open up. Ooh. Deals necrotic damage. What's in here? Send that to the camp. <sighs> One day I'll catch a break. Court bow send that one to the camp. Scroll of summon closet, whatever the hell that means. Some gold. I got a feeling that every time. Oh, don't mind if I do. What are you doing up there? Whatever. I'm about to open this guy up. Oh. Send that to. Gale. No traps, please. Nothing there worth having. What's inside? Ooh, a dark journal. Hmm. Search the cellar, huh? All right, so let's real quick have a look. We're at 1D8 on the light crossbow. And the longbow is 1D8. So we'll just send those to the camp. Or we'll give one to... My faith will guide me. Where am I needed? Maybe we'll give one to Will. Yes. Hmm. A hero at heart. Oh, not proficient. Okay. All right, well, we went slightly over time on this particular video, so we've killed the we've killed the undead in the immediate area, and in the next video, we will move into this next area and try to see if we can negotiate with the ornate mirror. But uh but yeah, I hope hope everyone has enjoyed the video so far and I hope to see everyone in the next video but until then I'll see you next time